this is really cringy because I don't do YouTube. I want to do YouTube, and yes, I have clothes on. I have a tank top on. I'm just really cold. Um, so, I have this, it's like, what time is it? I'm, just, I'm recording on my phone. It's like 12 o'clock right now. Yeah, it's 12 one right now. So, that's why I'm recording on my phone, because the light is like really bad, but oh well. Um, I've been thinking that I want to get a new animal soon, and um, my mom gets her taxes soon, so, um, me and her both agreed that if I clean my room and I behave, I'm not like behave, but I have, I do have a younger brother and we tend to fight a lot over the dumbest stuff, but it's him who always starts it, not me. But, um, I was thinking about getting a ferret. Yeah, a ferret. A ferret sounds weird, but I've had a ferret before. His name was Max, and I was like, maybe like 13. It was beginning of the summer when like I first got him, and I was like, always going to the beach or outside with my friends, and then I was like 12. Yeah, I was 12 when I got him, and then like, now I'm 14, and there's nothing to do, and everyone like moved out, except two of my best friends. Um, we still live here, and I go to their house a lot, but now that I'm older, I'm going to be a lot more responsible, and I legit did a heavy-duty cleaning in my room. I know it's not a lot yet, but um, I will clean a lot more if I do end up getting, if it's a yes, then I will, like, clean a lot better than this, like, where, like, there's no cords on the ground, so, like, because, like, they're, they're really hyper, they, like, they, like, jumping around, and they're, like, biting stuff, and they're, like, they're, like, cats mixed with dogs, like, you know what I mean? Um, I'll show you around my room, so. Okay, so, like, when you walk in my room, you see my bed and a spare bed. Um, the only problem really is that I need to keep an eye out when I get it. The bed underneath it. I don't want it to go underneath there and like find something and chew up. Like that's what I don't have to worry about. Like underneath there is because they won't like get like caught underneath there and like chew stuff. And then like I'm just gonna clean up the sides. I just have like like this in like a pole thingy that went to like um a shelf. Then right there I clean that up before I get it and like the cords. That cord and this probably will be, like, I have a chair that goes underneath it, so I'll just, like, put it on the chair. Um, underneath there scares me a lot because if you come from this angle, it could go underneath there, and I don't want it to go underneath there. So, like, it has a lot of room to play with, like, not, okay, yeah, this place right there, that has an angle too, but I'll put, like, blankets around the stuff when I let it run around on the floor but like obviously I'm gonna have something that will be like blanket right here blanket right there right there then have something like blocking off right there so it can run around pretty much because right here I don't have to worry about that but I have to clean that mess up and my bed looks nice I don't know what kind of cage I'm getting first it probably will be like to this to there and then the food will go in here and everything. I moved my makeup down here because food is important. And then, like, I'm going to put, like, the bedding stuff in there. So, yeah, I had a ferret before, but I've never really took care of it because I was only 12, so my mom gave it away, like, maybe the four months that we had it. And I, like, regret that because I really love ferrets. And, like, they're my favorite animal. Of all time, and I'm um, excited that I'm older now and I'm being trusted. So, this is my room. So, it's pretty big for it to run around. So, yeah. You can see, I showed you, like, the places where, like, I'm scared about, but, like, the other places that are, like, um, good. Um, like, I feel like Ferret is, it's like, it's like a dog and a cat, and I, like, Ferrets, they're, like, so adorable, and they're so cute, and they're, like, are, like, more playful than, like, hamsters, guinea pigs, bunnies, um, what else is there? Chinchillas, like, I've never had 
any of those kind of animals. I've had um two uh I had two jumbo rats, like like their their pet kinds, and then I had four mice, fancy mice. Um those were a handful to take care of and like they kept fighting so I had to give them away because I can't keep on like like I don't want to keep them in the same cage but yeah I like I separated them so like they wouldn't fight but I can't keep on buying cages after cages after cages while they keep on fighting um so that's why I gave them away and then I had to give away my ferret because I wasn't um, watching it like I was supposed to and I wasn't like taking care of it because I was like only 12 and like a ferret was a big deal to me and then like I brought it outside a couple times and that was it. I like gave up on it and I felt so bad. I loved it so much and I wish I still had it but I had to be dumb and not take care of it. I wish I had him now. He's so cute. Like. My mom follows a girl on Facebook who took him, and he's so happy now, and I'm glad he's happy now, because he has, like, four other, um, ferrets, too, with him, so it's, it's good. Um, I think that's all the, like, pretty much the animals I had. I had a ferret, um, two rats, four mice. I do have three dogs and two cats right now, and a fish, so it's not that much, but, like, usually, like, I just want an animal to be in my room like the cage like I have like bad anxiety and I want something to be there with me like going through a tough time I just want to see like a little bundle of joy just run around and make me laugh like my dogs like yeah they call me down and everything but they can be a little butthole sometimes and it's like why can't you be nicer like yeah and like summer's coming and I want to take out walks because I live in a trailer park, and, like, there's lots of places where you can walk, like, walk animals and stuff, but, like, I don't really feel safe because there's, like, a lot of, like, loose dogs around there and a lot of mean dogs. Like, I'm not pointing, I'm not, I'm, like, I'm not pointing fingers at any breed, but I'm just saying, like, people don't know how to tie their, like, chains up, like, their dogs to the chains and everything, right? And, like, there is some dogs that are not trained to be around people and that do sometimes get off leashes. I've... Me and my friends caught maybe four dogs last summer, but they were all nice, thankfully. They are all nice, and I think two times was the same dog. So, it's good. Um, yeah, so, if I get him, I'll take a video and show you guys. So, hopefully I get him. I really do. But I'll be making a video tomorrow. This will be uploading tonight. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.